Welcome to our lecture online. Now let's take a look and see if we can apply all the techniques we've learned so far to this next example. So notice that we're trying to solve for a, so what we're going to do is we're going to cir circle the variable we're solving for. Now notice we have a fraction here and minus c on the right side. Since the variable we're looking for is in the fraction, we want to get rid of the minus c and move that to the other side. So, in other words, the minus c moves to the left and becomes a plus c once we cross the equal sign. So this becomes x plus c is equal to k divided by q plus a. Now what we can do is we can cross multiply. Notice that this, if we think about this being x plus c over 1, we can move things across the diagonal. So q plus a can move to here and the x plus c can move down. So we end up with a q plus a is equal to k divided by x plus c. And finally, since we're looking for a, we need to get rid of the q, move the q to the right side, and we get a is equal to k over x plus c, and the plus q becomes a minus q on the left side. And that is how we solve for the variable a.